Daytona, they party fast. Out in Grove City, they go make it last. We've got $3,000 off factory list on Mustangs, all of them, and $4,000 off on Taurus. And down here, check this out, 7,000 on all the 150s in the corral and 7,000 off all the expeditions. What else can we do? It's time to party, seat town tonight. Your life is non-stop. That's why you need BAN. With invisible triple protection to stop body odor, a powerful antiperspirant, and a no-sting formula. BAN Clear. It keeps on working non-stop, just like you. BAN, an invisible band of protection all day long. I get cramps, I get backaches, I get irritable. Pamperin takes care of all of the symptoms. I've taken Tylenol, Advil, they just don't do it all. Pamperin takes the edge off the cramps and backache and irritability. Pamperin does it all. Pamperin, more than just pain relief, period relief. Leslie faced an impossible choice, her child or her marriage. Your ex-husband said, if we're going to stay together, you have to give this baby up for adoption. Exactly. Unforgettable family reunions on the next Montel. Today at 4 on NBC4. It's Friday, and many of you may want to go out on the town tonight, but you don't like leaving your kids with a babysitter you hardly know. In today's Smart Woman Report, Catherine Steele shows us how to make the right choice for you and your children when hiring a babysitter. Hi. Hi. Come on in. Okay. Janice Brandenburg likes an occasional evening out, but with two small children, that means she needs a good babysitter. It's difficult to find somebody that you feel really comfortable with. You know, I usually try to know their family and um, or have friends that know their family real well so that I feel comfortable leaving with them and know they have experience. That's how she found Michelle Pugh. Experts suggest you ask friends who they use. Janice's main concern? That they're watched real closely, safety. Safety should come first since nearly five children die every day due to accidents in the home. Leslie Price specializes in child safety. The hardest thing about hiring a babysitter is making sure that the babysitter knows what's doing in the market. You can ask if they've taken any emergency training to help babysitters. Michelle has. I know basic first aid like CPR. I can do CPR on children under five. You should screen a teenage babysitter by talking with their teachers and other clients, if they have any. Before hiring a nanny or professional sitter, ask if they passed a criminal check. And remember, if a service is bonded, it just means your possessions are protected, but not necessarily your children. Choosing a babysitter is, is of vital importance to parents. You are entrusting the safety of one of your most important assets to this person. Janice thinks she made the right choice, leaving her children with someone who will keep them safe and sound. Good night, Michelle. This is Katherine Steele reporting. And the Red Cross offers babysitting classes in most areas. And those courses are fairly inexpensive. They only cost about $20 each. A step closer to understanding Alzheimer's as doctors learn a little more about your brain and how it remembers. We'll have more details on that in a moment. And we will tell you about an exercise program that could be as easy as popping a pill. But first, Ben Gelber is working on the forecast. He'll tell us if it's rain or shine for the weekend when News Channel 4 continues. You work all summer on your landscape, but then comes fall and cooler temperatures and plants begin to die. News Channel 4's Tom McNutt will show you how to extend your landscape's life with potted plants. Today on News Channel 4 at 5. 5,000 students are working on their degrees at Franklin University. Call and find out how you can join them next trimester. There's speed limits, time limits, all kinds of limits. But this weekend at Heilig Myers, we're breaking all the rules and the sky's the limit. We've got credit for everyone guaranteed. Just come in and get your credit line, then use it on anything in the store. It's that easy. Plus, during this three-day event, there's no down payment, no interest for 90 days, and everything is on sale. The sky's the limit. This weekend only at Heilig Myers. Hey, I got a letter back from Quaker. I wrote and told them that Quaker toasted oatmeal ought to be called Quaker tasty oatmeal. It's oatmeal, it's toasted. To me, that says tasty. Well, then they should call it that. You need a hobby. Quaker toasted oatmeal. It's your other oatmeal.
Save during Mattress Mart's five-star sale. You'll save hundreds of dollars on many of our most popular King Coil mattresses. And with your qualifying purchase, you'll receive a free bed frame, a free mattress pad, free removal of your old bedding, free setup of your new bedding, and free local delivery. And as a special bonus, you'll also receive 12 months same as cash. Five-star quality, five-star value, five-star service, and five-star financing. It's all happening now during Mattress Mart's five-star sale. At Bob Boyd Lincoln Mercury, we're having a year-end clearance sale in the middle of summer. Come in today and take $9,000 off any new 1998 Lincoln Town Car. There's over 150 new Lincolns in stock for immediate delivery. Remember, we'll take $9,000 off on any new 1998 Lincoln Town Car at Ohio's largest Lincoln dealer. Bob Boyd Lincoln Mercury, 1100 South Hamilton Road, Columbus, where you'll get a deal you'll feel good about. And now, forewarned storm team meteorologist Ben Gelber with weather. Our flirtation with fall is about to come to an end. After another morning in the 50s, 44 up at Warren in Northeast Ohio, it's now back to hazy, lazy summer days through the rest of the weekend. First of all, though, let's take a look at Tower Cam and our live shot downtown already showing a little more haze in the air than what we have had recently. Big news story, though, is going to be Bonnie. Bonnie could threaten the southeastern United States later in the weekend. Already hurricane warnings for the Bahamas. Winds up to 65 miles an hour and growing. A tropical storm will probably be a hurricane before long. Tracking west-northwest at 17. Also, spiral rain bands now suggesting a tropical depression is forming 180 miles east of Brownsville, Texas. You can see Bonnie churning north about 100 miles to the north of San Juan, Puerto Rico, heading for the Bahamas and perhaps a rendezvous with the southeastern U.S. coastline later in the weekend. Let's check out our numbers outside. It's starting to heat up and turn a little more humid with the temperature getting back up to near 90 degrees today, a sign that we're returning to typical August weather. A west-northwest breeze, humidity 31 percent, and the barometer 30.41. The jet stream had dipped down from Canada. Boy, was it nice. Lows in the 40s, temperatures only in the 70s and low 80s in the afternoon hours. That cool pocket of air is obviously lifting out now, and that means it's back to reality, heat and humidity. But as this trough in the jet stream begins to dig a little bit into the plain states, that will finally pull enough Gulf moisture northward to generate scattered and welcome showers and storms later in the weekend and, more importantly, early next week. 82 right now at Port Columbus. It will be in the upper 80s at the Ohio State Fair with a west wind at about 5 to 10 miles an hour. A nice day. Showers and storms aimed right at us, but no chance of surviving in the drier air, just evaporating as they moved into central Ohio during the late morning hours. A couple of stray cells will develop over the weekend also to the north, but the same situation may occur again as this front just kind of waffles to the north. The collision between warm, humid air and cooler air generating the storms, but the air over us relatively dry, not really supportive along with weak dynamics to generate anything more than a scattered cell, a shower or storm. High pressure pumping up the southerly winds over the weekend, so it will feel much more summer-like. For the theme parks, 82 at SeaWorld, 84 at Cedar Point, 87 at Kings Island. Just a stray shower in the northern portion of the state. Lots of sun for us this afternoon, a high of 87. Humidity coming up, which means tonight will stay a little bit milder, 66. And as we go into Saturday and Sunday, again, a stray shower or storm only near 90. Best chance for rain looks like Monday, and then temperatures will begin to drop a little bit early next week. All right, Ben, thank you very much. We have some breaking news now. A major accident has stopped traffic at 70 West and 4th Street. Rob Case is in Chopper 4, and Rob, can you explain what the accident is involved? With yeah, it's at least, uh, yeah, there's at least six vehicles involved. We'll get you right down to the action and show you. It's 70 uh, uh, westbound right here, and uh, it looks just like a lane change. This is right at 4th Street where they all kind of come together. We'll try and give you a, a, a zoom in here and give you an idea what uh, happened, but it looks like they had a lane change. Two vehicles in the front, a small pickup truck, then a car, and then a, a, a larger uh, pickup truck got hit in the rear end by a semi, and then a delivery truck hit the back end of that, that vehicle, and then one of the safety clean vehicles hit the back end of that delivery truck. The delivery truck's from Worley, and it uh, looks like someone may be trapped inside there. There are at least three or four, I'm sorry, four gurneys that are down there, stretchers, that they're getting ready to try and get some people out of there. Looks like we have some people trapped inside. We're not sure the extent of the injuries. This just happened. In fact, the uh, we saw some of the emergency vehicles coming up to the scene. So again, this is 70 westbound. The traffic is backed up all the way past Children's Hospital coming this way, backed up on 71 all the way to Broad Street. Also, we have some slow uh, 
traffic obviously going by this accident scene as they've got uh, emergency vehicles on both sides. So 70 westbound, in effect, is totally shut down westbound at 4th. They're diverting people off onto 4th and then trying to get them back on a little bit later down on the other side of downtown. Things are not going well in this area at all. Okay, Rob, thank you very much. That's Rob Case reporting live for us from Chopper 4. And, of course, we'll keep you updated on that accident with our hourly updates. In health news this afternoon, scientists say they have figured out how to look into the brain and see if someone can remember something or not. Researchers at Harvard and Stanford universities recorded the brain activity of hundreds of people and they saw an increase in activity in certain parts of the brain when someone was recalling a memory. The breakthrough may someday give scientists more insight into Alzheimer's disease. How would you like to get all the benefits of exercise simply by taking a pill? Well, doctors are now experimenting with a pill that is able to mimic the effects of exercise in lab rats, and they think it could someday work for humans. Even though the pill can strengthen muscles, it does, does nothing to strengthen the heart, so some exercise would still be required. Was Viagra put on the market too soon? The Public Citizens Health Research Group says yes, and it wants federal regulators to take a closer look at the drug. The group says Viagra can have negative effects on the body and that the instructions don't adequately warn patients of possible side effects for people with heart conditions. The FDA will consider those charges. On the other hand, Pfizer, which makes Viagra, says it's actually bringing men into the doctor's office who haven't been there in years. The study shows that of the one million men who stepped into a doctor's office for Viagra, 30,000 were also treated for diabetes, 50,000 cases of heart disease were discovered, and 140,000 men were diagnosed with hypertension. A young boy is alive this afternoon thanks to his little brother. NBC's Vic Lee has more on this amazing story. Years ago, his doctor said he needed a bone marrow transplant as soon as possible. But Joshua's parents are of different ethnic backgrounds, and that posed a problem. Me being black and my wife being Filipino, and that mixture, it makes it um, a little difficult. Um, so you don't have as many people to, you know, to, to pull from. Searching the National Registry for a donor proved unsuccessful. Joshua's future looked grim. Doctors then suggested an umbilical cord transplant to take the blood from the umbilical cord of Joshua's soon-to-be-born brother and transplant it to Joshua. We always wanted another baby, and I mean, this is definitely a reason to have a baby. Um, knowing that it isn't guaranteed, and the doctors definitely told us, hey, it isn't guaranteed because you have a baby, it's going to be a match. Sure enough, doctors found through prenatal testing that it was a perfect match. In fact, it was the best match possible. I would always like to use a sibling donor, either it's bone marrow or it's cord blood. You know, Why? In because we have less complication. The chance of rejection is much lower. And we'll be right back right after this. It's here, the huge red tag sale at Mattress Warehouse. Save hundreds on Sealy, Serta, and Simmons mattresses. Plus store-wide savings on futons, bunk beds, soft side water beds, adjustable beds, and wood beds. We're liquidating one-of-a-kind items, manufacture samples, floor models, and more. Hurry while quantities last and pre-financing is still available. During the red tag sale at Mattress Warehouse. Now more than ever, there's absolutely no reason to shop anywhere else. Amazing hefty one zip food bag. It clicks closed to lock in freshness. The little guy's got spunk. One zip, the hefty duty food bag. used to running on high octane. Johnny Benson starts every day with a high energy breakfast, like this whole grain oat pack Cheerios breakfast. And where can you get such a high energy breakfast? Meyer, where you'll find low prices on a large selection of fruit, 
juices, breads, milk, and the one and only Cheerios. We start with a high-octane breakfast every day. So fuel up with Cheerios at Meyer and find low prices on top of low prices every day. Maybe we should have taken Mommy's car, you know, the one with the trunk. Let's go once again to Rob Case in Chopper 4, who is over a major accident downtown, Rob. 70 westbound at 4th Street, Clark. People trapped inside. The first vehicle on the right is a safety clean oil services vehicle. Cabs totally smashed into the back of a delivery truck from Worley. They deliver plumbing supplies. We believe the drivers of both of those vehicles are trapped inside. They've got four gurneys sitting out there just waiting to uh, try and extricate the bodies from the uh, inside. Uh, we believe, uh, we don't know the extent of the injury, so we believe they're just trying to still get them out. It's going to be shut down in this area for quite some time. You might want to avoid 70 westbound and downtown. We'll have more in an hour. Rob, thank you very much. We'll check back with you then. Thanks for being with us this afternoon. Drive safely on the roads, everyone. Have a safe weekend. You know, if you don't know how to read, every day is like running 99 yards and tripping. You always come up short but it's never too late to learn to read. Sign up for Time Warner, and your $5 installation fee will be donated to the Literacy Initiative to help someone learn to read. Help Time Warner Communications fight adult illiteracy. Because if you can't read, you can't win. No insurance, goodbye license, goodbye paycheck. Say hello to Safe Auto. Say hello to a super low down payment and low, low monthly payments. Hello, officer. Safe Auto is open now, so you can get the state-required minimum insurance you need. Do it now before you have to say goodbye. Hey, safe. If you're in debt from $2,000 to $50,000 or more, we can help you. Are creditors calling you at home and at work? Put yourself in this picture. Your past due on your bills, credit cards, department stores, medical bills, and unsecured loans by 30, 60, or even 90 days. Through debt consolidation, you can combine your bills, reduce your monthly payments, and reduce or eliminate interest. Call Credit Guard of America, a nonprofit company, today at 1 888 Guard 10. If you're a homeowner, the Window and Door Factory wants to offer you a warning. Not all replacement windows are the same. If you're in the market for replacement windows, you should buy from a manufacturer. The Window and Door Factory manufactures and installs their windows and gives you the best price on the highest rated window in the industry. And while other window companies may try to imitate them, they can't compare to their quality and value. Remember, at the Window and Door Factory, you'll always, always, always get the best price. Count on the Ohio News Exchange for the news from where you live.